back to Twin Cities Live. Well, do you remember when you first tried to barter? Mm -hmm. Good deal, good deal makers back yeah, in grade school. Yeah, at the lunch school. table. Mm -hmm. Lunch table was a perfect way to yeah. do that. You traded maybe the juice box for the Twinkie or something like that. Right. Well, bartering has actually come full circle in this very tough economy. Yeah. It's actually a big, big deal. Making a comeback. The yeah. art of bartering is making a comeback and trading services or goods and getting the most out of your valuable dollars. But we want to know what are the best tools to barter, but we have an expert mm -hmm. in the know. The shop cop, consumer expert and author Jennifer Litwin is here to tell us all about bartering. It's back. This is exciting. So is, is bartering seen, have we really seen a big growth? This is such a big business this year. It's gone up almost double what it was last year. And, and, and you're right, you can trade services, you can trade goods. And, and the key is that you're not spending any money. It's like the oldest form of trading that yeah, we know. Absolutely. So first up, we have the best part about today is you can do it on the web. And this is fun to right. show the websites that are the best to use. And the first one is Zwaggle.com. Zwaggle. Zwaggle. Well, the websites are great. Zwaggle's a funny name. It took me a while to, to practice saying it, but <laughs> I, uh, I love this website. Site. And what's nice is that you can share the goods that you've used before with your children. Let's say they've outgrown their cribs or their car seats or sure. booster seats. Happens all the now time. they need new stuff or they're moving on to toys or, or bigger and better toys. You can swap all of that. And the nice thing is if you live in a smaller community, you may not know a lot of other people that you can share things with. You've got the internet and, and Zwaggle's a great site. And you can find people right in your own community to, to make those trades with. And so what, you, yes, you, you negotiate a time, just like I suppose like Craigslist or something like that. You Priceless. find a time to meet and yes, and you can you can hand it off that way, or uh, you can just start to donate your own things. You 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 provide all your own goods. I hope more people will do this, and you get points. Those points will enable you to to get more stuff in the future. Aww. So whether you ship it or you pick it up somewhere, it's a it's a nice thing to do. And you've been family. bartering some things, right? Yes. So my son is an avid reader. I traded some books that he was sick of for, you know, Pendragon, some of these other popular books. My daughter was done with uh, her doll. We got rid of uh, a doll and we got a bigger doll, you know, hmm. the, the more uh, high-end. Yeah. High okay. Doll, so. And good. there's a little Nintendo thing Nintendo, you got? Nintendo, right, the DS. All right, when you talk about yeah. services as being a great way to barter, a great thing Big, to barter, and right. care.com is a site yes. that helps you do that. Yes, so this one is a site that I really personally like because we're all strapped for time and money and we don't have the ability to always do everything we have to do you know that we have a checklist for every day and let's say we're taking care of our kids mm -hmm. we need to drive them we need to cook for them we need to you know make sure somebody's watching them walk our dogs things like that this is a site where you can exchange services and particularly if you're taking care of an elderly family member and you don't have the ability to do that because you've got the little kids at home, you can share services with other families in the same boat. Mm, so for wow. instance, maybe you're good at sewing, you can make a blanket for somebody if they can walk your dog. Right, exactly. Oh. And you know, just like anything else, you want to check out the family that you're going to be working with. You want to make sure that you're a good fit, that they're close by geographically. That's, you know, the key too is finding somebody who's close by. Just marketplace to kind of work those things out. Right, even okay. swapping meals. You know, like one day we bring dinner to your house, and oh. the next day you're hey, going to bring dinner to our no. house. This is pretty then cool. Then you don't eat those dinner. I told you this would right. be cool. Okay, the last one is youexchange.com. What is that, and how does that work? Okay, you exchange is everything. It's the largest of all bartering sites, and there are 60,000 subscribers. You can exchange Whoa. anything. So let's say you've got a house in... Uh, let's say you live in New York and you know somebody else lives in Massachusetts but you both need to move to the other state then you can swap houses and in this real estate market <laughs> that, that's oh a gosh. nice thing well, that would be something else wouldn't it you know Some... vacation homes is another way to go the problem here is when you start to exchange services uh -huh. and you don't really know what you're getting into but like you know I saw a woman the other day she was swapping scrapbooking ideas consulting for calligraphy lessons that's you know seems like a nice one but like if you've got contractors coming to your house service people you want to make sure you're not going to get stuck with some you know crazy person in your house right. so that's kind so. of some of the negatives with this is that Definitely. you really have to be aware because sometimes Definitely. it kind of sounds like a crime waiting to happen with these things mm -hmm. yeah. but I have a news background so that's probably <laughs> I get concerned <laughs> you and it's true I mean it really is true you, you know you worry about these kinds of sites for that reason but the, 
the key again is that it's free. And if you can get something that's an even value, then you're it's a win-win for everybody. Very good. So. Thank you. Just, well, just use common sense and common caution, I guess. Yes, and a lot key. of these sites are new, so they may not have a lot of inventory. So the more you can donate right now, these sites are looking for donations. At least good. worth There's checking that. out. Yeah, absolutely. Thanks so much, Jennifer. Thank appreciate you, Jennifer. It. Thanks, we really on. appreciate it.